The City of Ithaca Police Department is trying out a nationwide safety program in one of the city's most crime-ridden neighborhoods. WMY Samantha Potter speaks with the Ithaca Police Department on the Officer Next Door program and how they hope it will clean up the West Village apartment complex. For the past few months, two Ithaca City police officers have been living here at the West Village apartment complex, one of the city's most crime-ridden neighborhoods. Through a deal made with the property owner, the officers live rent-free. It's part of the Officer Next Door program in which police officers can live in high crime areas at a low cost, all in an effort to keep residents from breaking the law. It's all in the name of improving uh, the quality of living up there in West Village. We want to make West Village the best village. While this form of community policing is still very new to West Village Apartments, the residents I talked to say they have high hopes that a police presence will help to reduce crime. And I think it's also a great idea. Uh, you know, it also it's another opportunity for the community and the police to uh, you know get closer together and and to, you know to improve the uh, area. When the officers are off duty, they aren't expected to answer calls unless it's in a life or death situation. You know, there are no expectations of him to to do anything outside of what he would normally do if he were a, a police officer that was in the area. You know, his presence in and of itself will be a deterrent to crime. In another effort to clean up the area, the property owners, Omni New York LLC, helped fund the West End District Office, which sits just about a mile away from West Village Apartments. I'm glad to have that down here. I think it's good for the West End. I work in the West End, and so, uh, you know, I'm happy that it's, you know, that there are more police presidents, both presence both where I live and where I work. The City Administration Committee overwhelmingly approved the program and created an exemption to the city code that prohibits city employees from accepting a gift valued at $75 or more. To fully formalize the program, it still needs Common Council approval. The Ithaca City Council is expected to vote on the Officer Next Door program on Wednesday, February 3rd. Officer Williamson says he doesn't expect too much pushback. Reporting in Ithaca, Samantha Potter, WENY News.